I don't know, creator, some Bitcoin maximalists are trying to get proof of stake crypto assets banned. Did you hear about this? No, this, this is wild. Who remember man, the man, Bitcoin maximalists have become exactly who they started out to try to fight. That is, I was going to say banned by who? Government. They want the government to regulate crypto. Yes. Interesting. Anything. <laughs> remember, they self admittedly, they would join the Nazis if they believed in Bitcoin. Self admittedly, they're a cult. Self admittedly, a cult, a toxic cult. As long as you believe in Bitcoin, it doesn't matter what else you believe. If you're racist, if you're sexist, if, if you're, uh, you know, a criminal, whatever. As long as you believe in Bitcoin, then they fully accept you. And if you don't believe in Bitcoin, then you are the devil. They want to send you to concentration camps. That's the kind of people these people are. They literally, the, the guy, whatever his name was, George yeah. or Alex or. Alex something. Alex Vecca. That's what he said on my channel. It's crazy. Or on an interview with Bitcoin Magazine. And then, and then Bitcoin Magazine puts out a tweet. Oh, he really gave it to BitBoy. Good. Nobody believed that. Nobody believed uh, that guy won that debate. I got some great content after that, being able to talk about him saying Nazis are cool, pretty much. Uh, great time visiting the Capitol and meeting with members of Congress. Lots of activity here. Uh, after meeting various members of the U.S. Congress, he streamed live on his YouTube channel to update the crypto community in general and the Cardano community in particular. I was doing very discovered, uh, disturbing that he had discovered, namely that certain Bitcoin maximalists have been lobbying U.S. lawmakers to create legislation that places regulatory obstacles in front of every crypto asset other than Bitcoin. Wow. He said, I did discover that certain members of the Bitcoin community are actively telling lawmakers, what snitches, what little snitches, uh, to write into legislation that everything but Bitcoin is a security, to write into legislation every attempt possible to delegitimize or outright ban proof of stake, uh, proof of state, I suppose to say stake, proof of stake cryptos, uh, this is extremely disappointing and disheartening. I like to believe that we have political indifferences or technological differences or deferring financial incentives that we would fight these things in the marketplace of ideas and right. the marketplace of users and traditional competition. Uh, the attempt to co-op the U.S. federal government, which they process to ban your competition, is an, an, anathema? Is that how you say that word? Sure. Uh, to every single thing the Bitcoin movement was founded upon. I tend to agree. I mean, what happened to free market options, free market choice? That's the they whole point. They don't want that. Yeah. That's why these people are toxic. They're so stuck up their own, you know what, that they can't see how stupid they look. They, they, they are the scourge of the crypto humanity. The scourge, the Bitcoin maximalist. Uh, the, the fact that they're literally, now, can you imagine this? What is more likely to get banned? Proof of stake or proof of work? Right. What's more likely to get banned? Proof of work, for sure. Absolutely. It, no, even I don't not, think it will, yeah. but it's much more likely than proof of stake. It, yeah, not saying I agree with it. It's definitely stupid, but more, much more likely. Yeah. Anyone else feel like crypto is slowly selling its soul to the government? Uh, absolutely, but remember, it's a, it's a war, not a battle. We're going to go through stages where it feels like we're in the same thing the traditional markets are. There's going to be times where it feels a lot different. Um, you know, and it feels like it's accomplishing more, bringing people into the economy. But right now, we're definitely one of the places in the battle where the government is, you know, it has its nose in everything. Now, the Bitcoin maxis are inviting them to come in further. So, scary stuff, scary, scary stuff. 